What? I swear why to God. It, why does it keep on failing? The stream oh, it's should live. Be up. The stream should be up, but it's not recording. Yeah, we're live. Yeah, but it's not recording. Uh, that's quirky. Oh, okay, that's My cool. drivers just might be out of date, which is a problem, and I should fix that. But yeah. like I said, I will just screen record after the fact. So. Damn. Oh, I don't like watching myself. It's so weird. So don't watch yourself, bro. Dude, but I was, and I was like, ew. Ah, good morning. Good morning. Maybe the camera on. Alrighty, boys. So um, it's been a hot minute. We're good noise podcast. We're back for season two. Yo, hey, boy. Two. That's crazy. We, we rebranded and we have like a cool thing now. Exactly. We we, we're edgy we're now. red. We're red. Yeah. Bro, it's pretty, it's I, create, I got to create a banner yeah. because my whole fucking thing isn't broken anymore. Yeah, bro. bro. Yeah. Courtesy of Ferris. We never actually, oh, yeah. we didn't even say anything on socials that we were changing everything. I just like woke up this morning and everything was changed. I was like, oh, <laughs> Sorry, I got excited and I was like, okay, you're changing, you're changing. Yeah. yeah I just... I'm like, I kind of figured that's what was going to happen because that's just how it be sometimes. All right, we're supposed to introduce um, ourselves, right? Oh. That's the thing we do. I don't. Uh, yo, yo, I'm Glory. What's good? Oh. Yo, I'm a. Uh, I'm Shane. Please stop calling me God. My name is Shane. Hi. <laughs> Shane. Yeah. I'm Ferris. I'm Ryan. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and Atticus, Atticus yeah, joined for green. like two seconds and then just dipped. So we're gonna talk yeah. about some music today. Uh, We're gonna talk about all the music. Actually, today. all of the music, every single, well, most of the music, not all of it. Exactly. It's From the much, beginning of time, pretty, it's pretty much just whatever Rayanne found on Google. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, honestly. <laughs> Called out. You but, guys are welcome. Yeah. I know I'm amazing. Yeah. You honestly, are. like kind of, you kind of saved quirky. us. Yeah, because we would have never honestly. planned this. <laughs> we is this never entire planned. podcast is just based around what pops up on our Twitter feed from? Rock honestly, sound. honestly, yeah. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> rock yeah. sound and all. We press. are the podcast version of rock sound. We are professionals. Yeah. With this. I wrote just the whole list the rock sound and then like put them on the screen and talk about them. That doesn't actually happen. Yeah, but... don't make me do any more work over here. Remember when I said I felt productive streaming? That was awesome. <laughs> not gonna lie. <laughs> now I'm just over like, a, a now I'm over here like, like sitting at the I'm like, now please don't make me do any more work. I've done that. <laughs> Can I just put the list on screen and have other people read it so that we don't actually? Oh my god! No, we just leave the list. <laughs> we just on go the live for two we just hours. Leave. Yeah, and then we just. Uh, sorry. Corey, didn't you want to like script the podcast at one point? No, yeah. I did not. I never said script the podcast. No, she always wanted to have. Oh, I made a joke. I made a joke about scripting the podcast. Yeah, she always <laughs> she always wanted to have a uh... like a halftime part. That was pre-recorded. Oh, yeah, I remember oh, yeah. That. I was just, and then and then Jesus no no Lord. but the halftime part was for like okay guys so we finished this what are we gonna talk about next yeah, Glory you know literally, and... Glory literally breathed and I said that's not happening. Yeah. <laughs> and so did everybody else. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. you and me, Shane, we we yeah. were like no we're yeah, not doing this. I'm not shit. doing that. And I was like I could do it all myself. <laughs> and you guys were like that's still not yeah still no not no no we're, we're not we're not a game I'm not show. <laughs> we're a game show. We're not a game show, bro. <laughs> but it would be so much. Okay. No. Bro. It's fine. Maybe the price is right. No. Bro, can we? Oh my god. Glory. <laughs> wait, this does that thing fall on wait. April Fools? This wait, is what... wait, wait, wait. Why did you give her an idea, Rayanne? This is what happens when we don't stream. I didn't. This I is just what happens when we don't stream for two weeks. The price is right. We... Let's do it. We Scrap this whole episode. We're playing with prices right right now. Okay, guys. We're not. So, guess how much no, this not. phone was? Are we uh, supposed to be talking uh, about music? Shut are up, we don't... live? Shh, shh. We are, we are, but we haven't streamed for two weeks, so we're gonna act like crackheads for a bit first. Okay, we're, 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 we're out of right? it, so now we're just talking. Oh. <laughs> Can we all just... Empty air, empty, empty air! air, empty air, empty air. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, okay, let's just, let's just get on with the latest. Hey, Jesus hey, hey, Rayanne, hey, Rayanne, that's my job, shut up. Um, Whoa. Don't no. Be Anyways, Weezer Teal album. Am I right? Came out January twenty <laughs> fourth. Right? What right? a great album! Oh. Honestly, my favorite album by them. <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. It's it was what got album. me into them. Dude, amazing album. Yeah, Your it's cover of what got Billie my brother Jean is probably the worst thing I've seen all year. Okay. What's on that? <laughs> I'm I'm not gonna respond to that, but you know, you're you're entitled to your own opinion, and I respect that. You know, 
That's okay. Are there so much hate in your eyes right now? <laughs> I forgot. I have video cam on. I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah. Weezer T album. Um, it was a cover album, and it yeah. had uh, Take Me On, which is my favorite song um, on that album. Take On, whatever, what, you knew what I meant, okay? And that's, yeah. that's, still that's all that matters. Yeah. When are you dropping the album? I do the halftime shows. Oh, the same thing. Getting single Cyberbully channels or cancer covers. Oh my god, Shane's gonna tour with Jill album. Yeah, covers, it's gonna like, be. Covers. I'm gonna be the opener for the um, punctuation tour. Sorry to leak it, guys. Please! Oh my god. But according this to my going to be you sources, some papers just like singing Misha songs. Yeah, that's gonna be me, bro. Yo, Mr. Drive Kid, if you're watching, can the punctuation tour actually happen? Thanks. Dude, sir, yeah. they're still following. They're still following Happy. No, Bro, I, 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 like DM them and been like, I'm, hey, I'm tweeting more. them. I'm tweeting them because they liked the post. They they liked the tweet where it was like, hey guys, you you should do punctuation tour, and they both liked it. Uh -huh. And I was like, do something, but it's okay. It's okay. Wait, happy with that? Yeah, they yeah, liked bro. it. Here, I'm gonna do it yeah, again. Damn, that, that's some next level shit. Bro, that's some quirky shit. That's some quirky shit. So what's next on the um? What what happened? When when was that released? When was that the was, um? Uh, January twenty fourth was the Teal album. I mm -hmm. have not personally listened to Weezer. That's why I've been keeping my mouth shut. Um, but I think we yelled enough about it so as the well. The album came after the Black album. Nah, the Black album on here says March first. Um, I, um, I don't know. The list says it, it's all Rayanne's fault if it's wrong. Yeah, this was all Rayanne. Yeah. Sorry, I just came back. Yep, it's all Rayanne's fault. <laughs> all Rayanne's fault. Did, you did great. You did great. Wikipedia man. man. All right. Man. <laughs> Anyways, I just tweeted them again. God, what's um, wrong with it? Stop tweeting them. They're going to start hating you. It's okay, cause I tweeted on the podcast podcast account, so like I'm not losing anything. Yeah. Am I right? <laughs> am, am I right? <laughs> okay, but there's uh -huh. something actually wrong with the list. Uh -huh. I'm confused. No, no, we were just saying if there is anything wrong, it's all Rand's fault. Okay, yeah. Good. Anyways, listen, man, I got like last minute. I was out in public, <laughs> literally getting a haircut. Okay. And you're oh my god. Together a list for the podcast. That's some dedication, bro. I can't even put Honestly, things up on the social. I literally just finished up dinner. I'm so full of chili, and I'm just like. Let's let's fucking do a podcast. Bro, you're bro. filled to the brim with chili. That's kind of hot, though. I don't know. Dude, <laughs> chili is great. Don't make it weird. You're so broke. <laughs> Too late. I already did. Uh, bro. You're so I'm so Here, um, You guys get on to the second album shut, on the list. Shut up, Ryan. <laughs> so, Bring Me the Horizon released Ammo. I listened to it like twice. That's I don't crazy. know. It didn't really love that album. hook my attention. I'm not going to lie. I prefer Christ. their older stuff. Bring Me the Horizon is a band. And that's it. Really? Bro, that's oh, crazy. That's cool, I never would have thought that. Bro, that's I'm crazy, sorry, man. but I don't remember asking. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I must be Dory, because I don't remember asking. <laughs> Shut up. Okay, but all oh. dead ass. Like, it's a really good album. Shane has it's, no taste. It's experimental. But it's a really good album. It, I have yet to listen to it. You're not like I don't it. listen to that You won't like it. Listen to, like, two Bring Me the Horizon Songs. Actually, you know what? And I have a Bring Me the Horizon recommendation for Glory. Did you watch your video you didn't do homework? Yeah. Are you lying? No, I'm not. Leave me alone. Here, I have a, I have a <laughs> recommendation for Glory. You're gonna really oh, like God. this album. It's um. Do you be talking called, to us? It's called, called uh, Count. Your, it's called Count. Uh, uh blah, 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 called Count Your Blessings. So, oh, okay. The one I listened to was called Mantra, and it was pretty good. It may or may not be the death metal album, I'm not gonna lie. Interesting. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Sounds great. Yeah. <laughs> Glorious face. No, it's death nice. metal. You'll hate it. Appreciate. Very cool. Very cool, nice. very epic. I'm very quirky, bro. It's high I'll definitely quirky. listen to that tonight. Yeah, yeah. Well, It'll keep you up at night. Wonder's Eyes Only is such a shitty name, and I love it so much. Bruh. Wait, this is the... Oh, God. Song name. 
Anyways, moving on. Oh no! I did the preview sound thing and it was just and I was terrified. Okay. What do death metal sounds like, Lori? It's death metal I don't like sounds it. like death, bro. It's not that death. See, it should be like melancholy deja vu. Take me, you know, you know what I'm saying? I still never I still never listen to that song. You need to. It's 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 good. It's chill. It was something else. Not never gonna listen to it again. Wow. Ouch. 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 Anyways, uh, set it so, off. Yeah, oh February 1st, Rayanne, midnight. Rayanne, go but crazy. You guys yeah. know, alright? I went to the concert for this album. Yeah, yeah, It was yeah. the best night of my life. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Bro, that's quirky. Tony Carson hugged me. I cried. Anyway, <laughs> though. Surprised. I don't know who Cody that is. Like. <laughs> Bro, you don't know who Cody Carson is? Ouch. He's the lead singer of Set It Off. Oh, cool, cool. <laughs> but, dude, I'm literally sitting right in front of a giant midnight poster, so that's the vibes right now. I think you can assume how much I like that album. Aren't you crazy? <laughs> Is that the one with the, um, the fire at the bottom? No. And I think it's something else. That's cinematics. This okay. is, it has the hands. Yeah. Oh, with, is it like the globe? Wait, yep. I'll send a picture. Hold on. <laughs> I'm so confused. There's so many hands in all of these um, album <laughs> covers these days. I set it off doesn't yeah. Earth community. I'm standing. Bruh. And, um, this is my my flag. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen that. I've seen that. Okay, cool. cool, cool. Favorite band is uh, set it off. Yeah, set it off is good. I, I agree. I agree. I, I like the um the Killer in the Mirror song, you know? That's, and that's the only one I know. I have a fine poster by them. One of my prized possessions. Wow. That's the one. <laughs> one of these days, on this podcast, I'm just gonna force y'all to listen to me fucking talk about the killers. That's gonna happen for like an hour. That's cool. Have they released any music? No. Not recently. I'm sorry, Ferris. Oh, the they're doing uh, in 2020. Yeah. So, oh, um, interesting, interesting. Well, that's all that apparently happened in February. Bro, bro, um, bro. I didn't get a chance. Only to talk one about midnight, thing bro. happened in February. Oh, you, you're typing, dude. Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. Bro, midnight. Bruh. Midnight was a good album. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I'm supposed to see set it off on January 30th. What the fuck? Uh-huh. What the fuck happened, to uh, everybody? Sorry, sorry. Uh, give, give me a second. Give me a second. <laughs> Give me a sec, give me a sec. On the spot, continue. January Bro, I don't like that my face is the only one here. <laughs> give me a sec, give me a sec. I'm uncomfortable now. Did you do? I'm gonna stop talking and I'm just gonna sit here. Okay. Bro. Okay, hey, but, um, I was going Sitting. to say something. I forgot what Where I was Where you see? Okay. Oh, Anyways. hi, Glory, you're back. Um, so I'm supposed Midnight, to see them on right? January 30th with Sleeping with Sirens, and I am thoroughly excited. Nice. Uh, yeah. Why do you keep saying thoroughly? Thoroughly, thoroughly excited. <laughs> thoroughly. It's his word of the day. Excited. Yeah, I picked a new word today that's not a curse word. I'm going to use it. <gasps> really? It's the word of the day so every other day of the year is piss. Huh? Oh. His word of the day every other day of the year is piss. It is. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> that's all that happened in February, it's apparently. Very cool. Apparently. apparently. That's all that happened. According There's a bunch of other things, but it's not stuff we know. Yeah, yeah. The only relevant thing that happened in February. Yeah. Okay. Sorry if you released an album and you're actually like, good in February. I. Yeah, I'm sorry. We probably don't care. <laughs> no, don't, don't say that. Stand happy. I'm sorry. Wait. Can you... <laughs> oh no, it's just me again. <laughs> I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> um, the best thing about me writing this list is that I know literally everything. So. Well, good. You can talk about yeah. Billy uh, Bibble's eyelashes album. Okay. Well, I don't know anything about. It's amazing, Billy eyelashes. Billie eyelashes. <laughs> <laughs> and I compl- Give me a and I completely skipped over Weezer too. So you should probably talk about that first. Oh yeah. Because <laughs> I. Well, I don't know anything about Billy Eilish, but Glory does apparently. And so does yes, Paris. I do. Stuff about Billy Eilish. Billy Eilish stand. Bro, right here. The black album. The black album. Yeah, talk about Weezer first. The black album. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, that, that came first. The black red too. Wait, when was it released? Huh? What month are we in? We're March first. Bro, that's crazy. <laughs> Bro, that's quirky. That's crazy. Bro. That must be Dory because I don't remember asking. 
I just used that one. <laughs> hey, uh, Ferris, Ferris, that was so funny, I forgot to laugh. <laughs> Congratulations on using a meme that was popular when we were all in second grade. Yeah, bro, I'm that funny. Why is everybody being so toxic right now? I'm that funny, Black bro. album. Come on. <laughs> I'm that Guys, funny, Billie Eilish. Black <laughs> Billie Eilish. No, Black Album. Black okay? Album first, then Billie Eilish. Black Album is fucking oh, wait, terrible. Was, I, you guys are not talking about the Black Album. All I said is that it was a really good album. <laughs> I haven't listened to it, but because it's Weezer, I'm gonna say it was awesome. Love Weezer. <laughs> love Weezer. Love him. Even though I've only listened Mary, to the Teal Mary album, did not know love him. Weezer discography works because no Weezer fan likes all of their stuff. Well, Twenty One yeah, Pilots. Like fucking Ratitude. Fucking nobody likes Ratitude, including like Ratitude. most. Doesn't like Atticus Ratitude. like Ratitude? No, Attic Atticus fucking hates Ratitude. I thought somebody he's here like, likes Ratitude. He's like an apologist for some of their worst shit. Atticus, what's going on? Oh, there he is. I was, we were just talking about you. All good things. Um, <laughs> oh, our cameras are so spread right now. Why is Ferris's thing in the middle? It's just a big flushed emoji. <laughs> Thank you, I made it myself. It's- it was my final art project. Here, empty air. Sam likes Ratatouille. Empty air! Uh, Talk about Billie Eilish! Yes! Right. Billie Eilish! Okay. So, on, uh, March 29th, Billie Eilish, um, Eilish- Eilish- Oh my god! Billie- Glory? Billy released a new Ooh. album uh, okay. called When We All Fall Asleep, Where Do We Go? The title is from a song, Bury a Friend, and it's like in the chorus or something. Um, and it's, it's really good. That was the first verse. No, it's not. It's not the first verse. Oh, um, it is. But it's in the chorus. So, I'm just not. saying, it's in the chorus. So, anyways, it's a very good album okay. with... I need to check my iTunes, because it has it there. Um, it has 14 songs, and it is a 43-minute album. All of them are really good, and I listened to the album. I think I have over, like, 400 plays on just that album. So, that shows where I am now. Um, and, yeah, Ferris, you've listened to it. Ferris? Ferris? What, what do you think about the album? Um, I liked it, and then I didn't. Don't Smile at Me is better. Um, Valid. But it's Valid. not bad. It's not bad. It's, it's a solid LP. Yeah. Um, okay, yeah. I, I used to like Billie Eilish a lot more than I do now. Like, three months ago. Yeah, you, but, you hated her a while back. I had sure, a debate with you. Like, and... She exists. Yeah. Um... But she she's still pretty cool. I, I respect her as an artist. Yes. Mm -hmm. I respect like, the grind. I refuse to listen to it. And she's me, so. Yeah. yeah. I refuse to listen to her album, but I respect the grind that she's on. And you know what? That. Yeah, I, I understand that. Yeah. that it's, cool. with, I think with, like it's with the reputation that she has, I understand that it's hard to like get into that. It's yeah, not even the, the... It's, it's not even her reputation. It's just the fact that it makes it's like quirky music too, for quirky people. too mainstream for me. Like I'm one of those gamers. Yeah. Like, that's, uh, too yeah. Okay. Yeah. that's too quirky. Also, for she's me. not alternative. People stop saying she's alternative. Okay, she's then what is she, dude? <laughs> what What is she? She's alt. Like alt covers a lot of things. Yeah. Because there's alt it's, rock, there's alt pop, there's alt everything. Not alternative pop. She's not alt. She's just alternative. Because she's not pop, and she's not rock, and she's not rap. So like, <laughs> we're alt just is an umbrella for everything. Wikipedia like describes that. her as like new goth trap, which is a that is not a thing. Nobody has you. <laughs> that is not a thing. They made that up a lot. Because that is not real. Yeah, but no, you're not real, Glory. God, you're not okay. Real. I you're I didn't this. think it would happen tonight, but I guess we're all right. Cool. 
Yeah, <laughs> but I think she's all because that's just how I describe her at least, but like if you don't want to describe her that way, that works. But what would you say she okay, is though? Girl. Like what would you say she is? Like if you had to put her um, in a genre, what would it be? Exactly. It's hard to genre her because genres are stupid and she kind of defies them, but she's not alternative in my opinion. Okay. What makes her not alternative? Um I mean like I don't even know how to describe it. It's just like she's like built off of like she's not pop, but she's like definitely built off. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, like don't smile at me was popish, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Don't, don't smile at me was way more popular than when we all fall asleep. Yeah, it was a uh, when we all fall asleep is definitely darker, and I would say a lot more alternative in the more alternative direction than don't smile at me. It's it's more in the dark direction. Yeah, but yeah. like it's still needs to get there. Billy should do a metal album. I yes. Mean, shit. Oh my god, no! She, but she has a quiet voice, so she can't really like scream. You know? But she should try. She should try. Probably. I agree. I'd listen to it. I I'd would. listen. Listen, if if Brandon uh, opera voice Yuri can do a fucking <laughs> yeah, yeah. hella metal scream, and so can so can fucking Billy Eilish. Billy Eilish. We love Pop you. Didn't Poppy go metal too? And look, Poppy does metal now. Yeah, yeah Poppy Poppy's metal too. I still haven't listened to that because no. she just freaks me out. She does. Not gonna lie, like no offense to her, she just she scares me. That's mm -hmm. that's just it. Yeah. Like she's she's, she's cool me. and pretty. Um. Scares me. Just don't get it. You just don't. You just don't listen to Poppy. Eva is not wrong. Yeah, I wholeheartedly agree. Anyways, uh, the main, they released an album. I didn't listen to it, but I saw them live. I don't fucking care about the main. I screamed at her. Anyways, I love the main. Yeah. Oh, all... wait, yeah. I didn't know that about you, Glory. What happened? I actually did not know that. Um, lost, but okay, the main. You are okay, March 29th. Whose family is fucking talking in the background? Bro, that's probably my mom's TV, bro. Just let her buy it. It's also man. probably my phone. But it's. It's whatever. Like the main. You are okay. March 29th, the same day uh, Billy's album came out, which is kind of quirky. Quirky. Kind of quirky. Oh, Advocates is here. I didn't even notice. Hi, Advocates. So like, we have so many albums to go, and it's already 7:30. Yeah. I'm yeah. Kind of vibe, bro. Well, I don't think anyone has an album. So let's go to Morbid it's stuff. A long way. Yeah. Let's go to Morbid. Yeah. Stuff. Let. Yeah, okay. Let's just- we don't have to go in-depth like how we did with Billy, we're just talking about, like, an overview, I guess, so. Yeah. Yeah, let's just run through these. <laughs> oh, morbid stuff. I listened to it twice, and then I had a falling out with the person that showed me, uh, Pup, so I refuse to listen to Pup now. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Pup, cut off. I know what you're saying. Yeah, I understand what you're saying, but you did cut off. But, like, the stream hurt you, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Did wow. Anyways, though, I I like pup. Um, that okay. made me this whole playlist. Like there. <laughs> but I also refuse to listen to it anymore. So. Yeah. Oh, interesting. It was a good album, but um, I refuse to listen to it. Thanks. Okay, but Andy Black? Black. Andy Black. Yes, I saw this man live, and Ghost of Ohio was something I played Look, on repeat for like. How you're talking about not liking pop. You listen to fucking water parks. Shut up. Water parks. <laughs> I'm still dead set on the fact that water parks is pop punk. Whether pop Austin punk, they are. Whether Austin Knight ignored me when you I called have, them pop punk to their face or not. You against Glory saying that they weren't pop punk. You said they were pop rock. Oh, pop punk, pop rock. Who fucking cares, bro? They're going more in a pop rock direction. Yeah, they're they're their in older stuff pop is alt. pop punk. Like. The, their first couple EPs were definitely pop punk, but they are no, they same are with Double Dare. Like, du Double Dare was also on fun. the pop punk side, and then they went more a pop rock direction, especially in fandom. But we mm -hmm. are nowhere near Water Park, so please shut your mouth yeah, and let let's... me talk about Andy Black. Oh yeah, exactly. right. Andy Black. Andy Oops. Black is very attractive, and that's he all made, I have to say about he this made album because I didn't listen to it. Valid, so. valid. <laughs> he has so, a really good. He does. And he talked about. Your voice is too deep. 
<laughs> he talked about um, uh, his his uh, ruptured appendix on stage when I went to go see him. Oh, I, thought you, I thought you were going to say something else. No, he had he had a story time when I saw him. So <laughs> that's about the only thing I remember. Um, but Ghost of Ohio, it's a good album. Nothing, I nothing thought I'd rather see in concert than someone talking about their burst appendix. So you guys know how that's typically I formulate an opinion on a song or an album, and then I eventually wind up going back on it because that's just how I am. Yeah. Um, the title track, Ghost of Ohio, was a single, and when it dropped, I could not stand it because, like, he just kind of repeats himself over and over and over again. Rayan, you probably know what I'm talking about because you've listened to it. Yeah, I do. <laughs> and I absolutely hated that song, but then it grew on me. I think it's one of my favorite oh. songs on the album. Yeah. Like, <laughs> reboot. Oof. I love that album so much. Yeah, I haven't listened to it in a while, but sometimes it, like, comes on my driving playlist while I'm driving, and I usually skip it, so... That's besides the point. Oh, that's what I'm good. <laughs> that's besides okay. the point. Okay. Um, that was nice. I don't think I put Black Veil Bride on this, on this list. Bro, you so. throw it on really quick, or we'll just talk about it. I know when it, I know about the time it released, so and I want to talk about it. So, uh, KG Elephant, did anyone listen to that? I don't think so. Rayanne, did you? <laughs> I've listened to some of the songs, but I don't know the name, because okay. it's just Pandora on my TV. Um, But the ones that I, I did hear, it was nice. It was a cool um vibe. I guess. I was planning on listening to it, and then once again, falling out with person. Never mind. Um, the Dead Days by Get, Get Scared. This Get is, scared. like, oh my God. top five Oh, April 19th. We're in April. Me. Like, this is but in the top five. That's the day before 420. They should have dropped it on 420. This is such a beautiful album, front to back. The Closer is one of the best closers, I think, for an album in 2019, in my humble opinion. Um... And just like oh no, man, it's I feel like, younger when we met is like right there. But so, I so we were gonna get there. Please stop yes. talking about water parks. It's not October exactly. yet, bro. Um, I like water parks. Shut up. The dead day, the dead days. It's a high quality album. I recommend you all stream it. I streamed it about nine hundred times. So, um, Ryan, got anything I to say about slept it? on that album for like so long you until did. I decided during a road trip, like a thirteen-hour road trip, to listen to it. And I listened to it straight through that road trip. Yeah, that's valid. Bruh. And that, dedication. <laughs> that album was about the only thing I listened to from the second it dropped until I got into the used in, like, late you? June. So, if that well, shows... It is a very good so album. you got into the used, like, recently. I didn't know that. Yeah, because I saw them in July, so I got into them before I went to go see them. So you saw them before you got into them. That's I had tickets bad. to go see them before before I listened to them, and I listened to them like a week before I went to go see them, and listened to them like 800 times in that week. So, Get Scared, it's definitely like top five album of the album of the year for me. Um, did anyone listen to AJR? I can just say AJR's shit, and we can move AJR's on. AJR's fucking gross. Yeah, AJR's disgusting. I like AJR, of course. but I haven't listened to their new album, because I just haven't gotten around to it, and it's not really like a priority for me. Um... AJR is kind of fucking gross, not gonna lie. Mood. Why do you say that? And that's about it. <clears throat> oh, she's mean. Describe how AJR isn't good, but it's not good. Yeah, AJR is garbage. <clears throat> Moving on. Catfish in the Bottom End. Did anyone listen to that uh, album by that band? No? Alright, New Year's Day. New Year's Day, bro. I see. Oh April 26th, New Year's, Year's Day. Day. Unbreakable. We need to say the date. That's the point. Shut up. Shut up. No. No. <laughs> so okay. I haven't I haven't what actually... Is the third of I don't think I've actually listened to Unbreakable in full, but I've listened to enough New Year's Day where I can tell you what it's going to sound like and that I, I can already tell you it's going to be a smacker, and I listened to a bunch of the songs because I played them live when I saw them. So... Mm -hmm. It's a good album because I said so. All right. And Ash, and, and Ash Costello's hot, so like that also helps. Bro, you have a girlfriend. What if she sees? It? She's watching, and you should see some <laughs> of the, she has that obsession with guns. I think I'm allowed to say that uh, Ash Lighting. Costello's hot. So guns, guns, guns in with, my DM. Guns with a Z, bro. Ash Costello oh. is in my DM. We so. love him here. Yeah. I don't understand. Dance. Yeah, Ash Costello um, isn't in my DMs. Guns is in her DMs, so like, I'm allowed to say she's hey. hot. Exactly. Yeah. It's, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Yep. 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 All right. Anyways, um, May eight, May May tenth. Okay. Sorry. Bro. May tenth. Charlie Bliss. Young enough. 
Did anybody? Uh, I have a little bit. Cause, okay. Because Eva forced me to. Okay. Okay. I enjoyed uh, it. But it's like very, very kind of like chill music, and that's mostly not my thing. But oh. it was pretty good. I mean, I'll listen to it again, definitely. <laughs> And please don't said, kill no. me, Eva. I know she's watching this. <laughs> Bro, you, you said chill music? Is it like, um, like, Rex Orange County type beat? Or is it like... I did not listen to- I don't even know that band. <laughs> you don't yeah. know- Oh my god. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Probably wouldn't have heard of them. They're kinda- they're kinda obscure. It's quirky. It's quirky But, fuck, um, bro. yeah. I need to check that out then. Thank you, Rayanne. Thank you, Eva. <laughs> yeah, you'll like that. Uh, okay, hopefully. Because that's yeah, my type of music. I'm the only one that can't pronounce her name. Igor. Ig. May. May. Oh my god, what is with eight? <laughs> May 17th. May 17th. Tyler the Creator yeah. released Igor. I Igor. <laughs> Igor. I don't. I. I don't no, know my brothers listen to him, so that's why I added it. This is um, crazy, bro. Okay. Um, yeah. Anyways, so Frank Iero and the Future Violence. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, anyways, <laughs> yeah. Anyways, Frank Iero and the Future Violence, he released <laughs> Barriers on uh, May, anyways, no. May 31st. I may or may not have seen him live on this tour, but I'm going to tell you right here, right now, I hated the album. It was, such a, <laughs> it was a huge that's disappointment. Valid. It was a massive disappointment. Same. I, 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 I listened to it and I was just like, this this is not bad. And it ended up being bad. Because I listened to it twice and I hated it. It's not even necessarily that it was garbage. It's just that it's not my kind of music. Like, I listen to heavy music, but like the unclean vocals that Frank has are just not this for me. Water parks. And um, it's just, it's just not for me. Yeah, yeah. I mean, and I should... for Frank's um, vocals, I'm sorry. Like, I know this might be kind of shallow to say, but I genuinely cannot get into bands with, like, shitty vocals. Yeah, I just, like, I don't know. It, it just wasn't good. I, I, I only feel bad saying that. I only bought tickets but... to see him live because I was like, I'm never going to get to see My Chemical Romance live. Might as well see Frank <laughs> live. <laughs> and then here we are six months later, and I'm probably going to be able to see... My chemical romance lives, so you wasted your fucking money. <laughs> just a little, just a little. Hey, but it's still the experience. It That's was not a waste cool. of money. It was like twenty dollars, and that was by f that show still has the cheapest That's merch. Actually cheapest That's actually cheapest. That's like still how has much the cheapest T-shirts. Show was. Yeah, he still has the cheapest T-shirts I've ever paid for. So wait, wait how much were they? It was just like twenty dollars for a T-shirt. Typically, they're $20. twenty dollars, yeah. bro. That's how much Dragon Pilot sells their T-shirts. Really That's good. regular. It's normal, normal. Bro. <laughs> bro. Motionless in white, June seventh. Oh, bro, 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 bro. Shut motionless up. in white, motionless in white. The sky is. No. I could probably do it track it. by track, but I'm just gonna like do the highlights here, so it opens. Really don't. Exactly. don't have that kind of time. Shut your mouth, Ferris, for two Let seconds. Him speak. Stop breathing, bro. <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying. Motionless in White uh, kicks off with uh, Disguise, the title track. Uh, it's a fat smacker, and then um, Headache is a very bassy tune. Much bass. bass. M lots of bass. Like bass. And then um, another noteworthy track would be uh, Another Life, which just, it just hits. It just hits different, bro. Like I'm literally just trying to vibe, and then Another Life comes on. I'm like, fuck, I'm sad, bro. And um, Brand New Numb is what got me into Motionless in White. And that's mm -hmm. also on this album. Um, mm -hmm. That you, it used to be like a 10 second snippet would play of it on an ad, and it would play all the time on my Spotify. And I'm like, hey, that smacks. So I eventually found it, and here I am today with almost 3,000. So, so you found Motion Listen White via Spotify ad? Yeah, Spotify ads are good just for that solely. Yeah, I feel that because I found mm -hmm. um, the dude with a typical story. I forget his name, but him. Um, Hobo, Hobo Johnson. Hobo Joe. <laughs> Hobo Joe. <laughs> um, I, I, almost, I only know one song from Disguise, and that's because music time. But yeah. it was, it's a very good song. It was, that it was, was brand new. Numb. I think I played for you. What did you say? I think it was brand new. Numb. I played for you. Brand new. Numb. Yeah, you did. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one, and it's very good. Jonas yeah. Brothers. <laughs> 
June 7th. Happiness Yo. begin. I like how we have all this like rock or alternative, and then we just have Jonas well, Brothers. Listen, and the Harry Jonas Styles. Brothers. Listen, the Jonas Brothers. I ten year old me wanted to love this album the one time I listened to it, but mm. um, I don't know, man. I don't know who allowed them to not record music like they're twelve anymore. But oh, no. I don't know who allowed them to mature and get older and write music for older people. <laughs> no, man. But honestly, Dance the album about, was like, complete garbage. So, like, I'm not surprised. This album was just complete garbage, and I hated oh, no. every second of it. And, and then, the, and then the, the, the kicker, bro, the real kicker, was when I saw them live. They played all mm. the new songs, so I didn't know anything. I just sat oh. there. I'm like, this was a hundred dollars, and I just stood here. A hundred. A hundred dollars, hundred and ten dollars. Look at the That's back of the stage. It's the fucking. And you didn't even get to kiss Joe Jonas I on the lips. I didn't kiss Joe Jonas on the lips. <laughs> no, but you did. Remember? What was the point? There was no point. What was the point? I wasted my money. <laughs> next <gasps> brother's bad. Next album. Next meme. Um, Chase Atlantic, June twenty eighth. Phases. Did, did anybody listen to that? No. I feel like that's nope. an album name that every band has. Phases. Phases. I'm pretty sure okay. Kendrick has that. Um, well, that's an album that happened. Um, go check it out. Cool. I haven't heard it. Poppy, June 28th. Choke. Choke. Choke me. Bruh. I don't know how song you like. I don't know how. Just choke me, bro. Well, that song played... <laughs> At a football game the other day, and yeah. Dylan didn't know about it. That shit's whack. That's crazy. That's crazy. Didn't they need like permission to do that though? Like, I don't think that's how it works. Football games. Really? They don't be like, oh hey, we're gonna use your song. And they're like, okay, that's not how it works. That's kind of yeah. stupid. Apparently. Anyways, like I poppy. Mean, they, they were just like, apparently we got played at the NFL. That's neat. <laughs> that does sound like them. That does sound like them. So, That's did anybody listen to Poppy? I, I did. You did? Tell us about it. Um, I'm Poppy. I listened to it like twice. I'm Poppy. Um, it's kind of screamy. Oh, okay. It's also good. But it's also like, it, big bass. Okay. So, was it good or was it bad? Uh, like, 7 out of 10. Okay, okay, 7 out of 10. That's decent, that's decent. That's good. Uh, okay. That's terrible. So, Shane, you should look at it if it's Poppy. Because, uh, like, no, not Poppy, sorry. Screamy. Yeah, I metal. Should. I've been meaning to listen yeah. to Poppy because she's went metal, but, like, I've been listening to nothing but corn for, like, the past month and a half, so that's where we're at. Yeah, fair. <clears throat> I would listen to Poppy, but, again, she just scares me. She terrifies she just, me, too. Who knew so she I, I don't I don't like her vibe. I watch some of her she YouTube videos. Scare me more if she wasn't like really pretty. Like, see, <laughs> shut up. I'm gay. See, I I watched some of her um like just videos a while back. When I think maybe when I was like I don't know thirteen, maybe twelve. I don't know. And I was just scarred. Um, because she just scared me. Style. In hell when I was like twelve. Wait, what happened? Um, I watched her videos when I was like 12 and they were interesting as hell because I was a fucked up kid. What, Poppy's videos? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was sheltered. Oh, well, we know. Yeah. You still <laughs> are. Yeah. Also that. We know. So, that's that. I'm not sheltered. Shut up. You're allowed to, like, do this. <laughs> no, I mean, okay, sheltered. But, um, some 41, July 19th. I listen to Order in Decline. Album. I listened to half this album once. That's all I have to say about it. So, wait, so... It, one of the band. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, I listened to half the album once. So was it good? I didn't hate it, but I haven't got, I haven't went back to it. I own it, too. Um, Why do you just own albums that you don't love? Um, yeah. Because I like to collect the physical media. And I'm a slut for music media, so like I have, I have just a bunch of CDs. Like I spent thirty eight dollars on the new Tool album, and I don't even know if I have any intentions of listening to it. So okay, next album. 
NF, July 29th, The Search. Ooh. I think we're only halfway. This is, oh my god. Wow. So, NF released an album. I don't listen to him, but one of my very old friends um, does, I think. Um, I've heard it's really good. Honestly, I think. I think I have. Um, I personally don't listen to him because I'm not much of a, a rap person, but, uh... Him is that, my that was a thing. Um, Half Alive, August 9th, now, That's not yet. yet. That's I've heard so much about them. I can't bring myself to care about them. They're, they're just kind of there. I like Half Alive. They're good. I remember that whole, um, during the hiatus, when 21 Pilots were, like, gone for a while, a while meaning a year. Um, people started accusing Half Alive, that's how they blew up, um, copying 21 Pilots, because he has, like, a similar, um, body language, I guess, with, then, like, no. that he shares with Tyler, I guess, like, it's with not, the handshaking, it's not shaking. copying, that's just being a guy. Uh, what? It's not copying, that's just having similar body language. Yeah, I know, but... Everybody was desperate for yeah, something related shit. to 21 Pilots, so they just accused this small band, and the band was like, we're not copying them. We see them, yeah, like, as them. idols, and we love them, but we're not copying them. And everybody was like, okay, that's cool. We love you now, by the way, because your music's actually good. Because it is. Um, so that's how I found them. And that was, like, maybe, like, two years ago, I think now, which is crazy. So, Yeah. Um, is Slipknot, August 9th, bro, bro, we are not your kind. Bro, 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 this is Shane's bro, time. Bro, 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 Slipknot? Um, I don't know, I... Slipknot, Shane. I obviously enjoyed We Are Not Your Kind enough to listen to it almost 500 times. I own it in about Ooh. four different forms of media. And, um... I, I saw them live for this tour. Um, but... Nice. I did not enjoy it as much as I have enjoyed some of their older stuff. Mm -hmm. Like, I have found myself going back to All Out Life and uh, .5, The Grey Chapter, more than I have anything else, including this album. So, that's all I have to say about that. Uh, Nero Forte get is out, out, literal, out, out, literal ear sex. Get out, get out, get out. So, get out. Um, there's that. Nice, sex nice. Of, sex of the ears. And, um, Ear. yes. and uh, Solway Firth is one of my favorite songs by them, actually, even though I don't listen to this album that often. Um, I don't have much else to say. It's not like an album. It's like in the running for my top five album of the year, but mm -hmm. it's like lower than Get Scared. We're getting to like what I would have to say is my number one in September. Okay, okay. By a band that starts with the letter K. Okay. So, Wait, we're getting there. Okay. We're getting there. Oh, yeah. God, I see it. Ugh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Brockhampton, August 23rd, Ginger. Did anybody listen to that? No. I thought one of you guys listened to it, so I added it, but I guess not. Anyways, guys. See, I was cool. going to listen to it, and then I forgot. Um, but I'm sure it was good, because I like Brockhampton. So, yeah. That's it. Tool, August cool. 30th. Fear and Inoculum. Did I spend yeah. $38 on the album? Yes. Have I listened to it? No. Will oh I listen God. to it? Probably not. That's all I have to say about that. Can you just send me, like, all of your CDs that you haven't listened to yet? Which I know is, like, all of your fandom CDs. So just send me your fandom CDs. Bro. You know? Yeah, you can have my, uh... I have, yeah, I have three fandom CDs and then a signed vinyl. Bro, yeah. give me the signed vinyl. No, That's... Uh, you can have the poster Sam gave you. You can have a signed. vinyl. Bro, sure, I'll take it. We need up. I'm just kidding. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. I'm, I'm kidding, too. I'm kidding, too. <laughs> Glory's like, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. Glory's um, uh-huh. Melanie Martinez. I, I... Melanie Martinez. Yeah? Melanie September 6th. K-12. Um, I thought K-12 was alright. Not as good as Crybaby, though. I hated I that album. It. I liked it more than Crybaby. Good album. I watched the movie, it was weird, it was badly directed, but that's okay! Because <laughs> it's good music! Valid, valid. Um, I'm personally not a fan of her, but, like, I, I- Again, she scares me, so, like, that's it. Melanie Martinez is... Uh, I feel bad saying anything about her, but, like... Ew. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. Alrighty. Well, that's, that's how Ferris feels uh, about Melanie yeah. Martinez. Okay. Melanie. How do you those are your thoughts. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. Melanie. Right. Is I. I, I kept saying Melanie, so I'm just gonna move it's on. Melanie, Melan, it's yeah. Me yeah. Oh my god, I can't read. Are you on? <laughs> what can't Sleeping with sirens, Sleeping September sixth. How it feels to be lost. Sleeping with sirens. So after uh, whatever the hell Legends was, uh, they came back, going back to their older post or their like hardcore sound. I don't know if you would call it post hardcore, but it was hardcore, mm -hmm. um, and um, it was good. It was very good. I uh, haven't listened to as much as I've, as much as I wanted to because like Corn released their album and I've forgotten anything else exists. Um, yeah, feel that, feel that. So it was a good. It's a solid album. I couldn't really tell you much from it because I don't remember much. But uh, leave it all behind. I listened to a lot and kind of sounds like uh, New Noise by Refused. None of you know who that is, but yeah. Um, that's all I have to say about that. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. <laughs> okay. Did yeah. anybody else listen to it? No. Oh wait, actually I did. Um, <laughs> okay, tell us about it. Well, tell us um, how you feel about it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to explain it. I mean, yeah. I enjoyed it. It was really good. Per like, I did like it, but I need to listen to it more to give like a detail explanation. Same. But it, it was good. I do recommend. Yes. Okay. Sleeping yep. with Sirens good. Yeah, and like I really like as much yeah. as I've as much as I'm like, hey, Sleeping with Sirens good. Like I really haven't dove deep into their discography. I was just kind of like, hey, I'm gonna go see them live. And um, but it, it, they're good. Kellen sounds like a girl. Oh, that's Sleeping with Sirens. See, Sleeping I. With Sirens. I get them all mixed up. Oh my god. Okay. Yep. Yep. Cool. <laughs> Post Malone, September 6th, Hollywood is bleeding. Yes. Uh, yes. Sorry. Yes. Okay. Post Malone is like the only artist that I will listen to yeah. outside in like that yeah. direction. And oh my god, I love him so much. He is such a sweetheart. And his his music is so good. And I love his voice. And I love that album so much. And one of my really good friends like adores that album. So it made she like she made me listen to it because I'd been like procrastinating. And when I did, I get it. I can see now. I the scales fell from my eyes. But like it, it was really good. Um that's all I have to say. Yeah. Rome, yeah. September sixth. Experience with this album. Bro, it was wait, did anybody did anybody else? No. I have taste, I'm sorry. D okay, buddy. <laughs> Alright. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> funny, funny. <laughs> Rome, September sixth. Smile wide. Did anybody What's the album again? <laughs> Smile Wife by Rome. Who the fuck is that? Rome is yeah. I like Rome. Rome is they did a they did a really good song and I have it in like all my playlists. They did a really good album and I have it like all of my playlists. Quirky. But I haven't listened to Smile Wide yet, I don't think. So that sucks. Alrighty, boys. Pensive. This is Selfish where, things. This is where September I come in. Bro. Oh, logos. I, Hi, my, yes, name, my name is things, Shane. Island things too. My name is Shane, and I love selfish things. Um, I've only <laughs> listened to the album a couple times, but they're like high up on my list of bands to see, and I'm actually getting a chance to finally see them in February, which is cool. But um, my favorite song is the opener track, which is called "Flood." Um, Mr. Highwind himself actually got me into this band and showed me "Flood." Wow! And was like, Mr. Highwind. Was, like, Wow, this band smacks. Must be like your cousins or something. Yeah, it's almost like we, That's crazy. we like see each other at Christmas. It's crazy. Um, That's but, crazy. It's uh, almost like he's been avoiding our interview. That's yeah, crazy. it's almost like I texted him and he never got back to me. <laughs> but anyways. Wow. Um, anyways, anyway. anyways, I really haven't listened to the album that much because like, I don't know, I just haven't because like Korn also released the album the same day. So, um, 
Yeah, it was good. I like Flood a lot, so I highly recommend that you all listen to Flood by Selfish Things. Um, anyways, moving I, on. I probably won't, but... You probably won't. I might. No, I, might. Well. I might. I uh, might. Anyways, Corn, The Nothing. Sweet September Jesus. 13th. Sweet Jesus, I've listened to this album 900 times. Like, I have 900 scrabbles on um, Last FM. I'm not proud of it, but that's where we're at. Um, so, like, I... When I was listening to the album, like, all day, every day, I actually found myself skipping the singles because I listened to the sk- singles so many times. But, feel that, feel that. But um, You'll Never Find Me and Cold are both good. Uh, Idiosecrecy is probably one of my favorite songs on the album. Like, I'm trying to picture the track list in my head, and I've listened to it so many times, I still don't know the track list. Um, Bruh. Oh, the picture plus the type. The Darkness is Revealing is good, too. I mean, pretty much, it's it's my album of the year, like, without contest. Really? Without contest, because I've listened to nice. it so much. And, um, yeah. So, Stream to Nothing by Korn. Thanks. Rand, awesome. this one's we'll, good. We'll this be. one's for you. Star Set, September 13th, oh, oh Division. <laughs> Dude, I was buying the quirky emote. Anyways. <laughs> Painful. Anyway, yeah, Anyways, uh, <laughs> Star Set, bro. Oh my god, I love it. Okay, Same. I had like a whole like thirty minute talk about it on one of the podcasts, so you guys know how much I love this album. I've listened to it so many times. <sighs> I'm in love with the album. It's so tell, good. Tell I highly recommend. It. Um, it's like. It's probably their heaviest album, I, I, I guess I could say. Okay. All their albums are concept albums, and there is the Scream song on it, and that's duh, the song. Scream song. There's like a two-minute Scream. Da <laughs> Scream song. Oh, no, is that the one that you shared on the podcast? No, I, that's shared where the skies end, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's not the Scream song, but it is a very good song. And you guys appreciate it, so yeah. I appreciate that. I listened to Divisions like <laughs> once in full. Yeah, it I... was like a, it was like a weird music time. Well, we all weird did it. Music we time. all did it like the same time. We were just like right yeah, on everybody trip, did it. and we were like, "Hey, it's Divisions like... time." And I got through. <laughs> yeah, I got through most the of the album. Yeah, I got through most of the album. I was like, Everybody "Hey, this is decided good." Decided to stream it at the same time. Yeah. Rand and I, yeah. I think we're um, like matched up for the longest time, and then she was like skipping intros and stuff, and she got like two songs ahead of me. Bro, <laughs> yeah. You dick. Um. Anyways, uh, next up, the fame, state of mind. Um. September thirteenth. Uh, I I love the fame. I didn't. <laughs> I did not know who the fame were until I saw them on the Andy Black tour, and Duffy. I um absolutely fell in love with their live performance. And then decided to listen to their studio stuff, and it held up. Um, so, stream State of Mind. That's all I have to say about that. I also I also haven't listened to State of Mind as much as I would like to because Bruh. we all know what album dropped on the same day as State of Mind. So, um, okay, but State of Mind, very good album. I is. I was paying attention to something else, but it is a very good album. And very very good album. You have Shane more- also got me the fame. I did. I got I, I got a bunch binge. of people into the fame actually. Yeah, Listen, you like, you dragged me into there, the fame. You were a, like stream a, the fame. There was a time where like all I did was yell at people to stream the fame, and it worked. <laughs> like that's the only you time. Atticus, yeah, that, um, that is the only time. The fame, like happy for glory to you. Oh my god, it. happy is. I wish they released an album because I would just talk hey. about it like glory. <sighs> Sorry. Yes. Stop the fame. The fame. <laughs> All I right. feel like I have you on a leash. Oh, Sleep wow. on it. September 13th. How I, many albums were released? I have nothing. Four to, albums. I have Pride nothing, and Disaster. Nothing to say Sorry. about um, Sleep on it besides the fact that I missed them over the summer. I don't listen to them, and I want to see them in March, but I don't listen to them. I just want to see them because it's pop punk, and I just go to shows to go to shows. So. Wow. Well. Yeah. I've only been to two shows, but, like, they were pretty 
Uh, I think I went to two shows in November. Wow. Oh, wow. You're so relatable, Shane. I am. Awesome. I, I am pretty, re- wow. pretty relatable. You're the relatable um, podcast member. That's huh? crazy. Bro. Blink Bro, I go to so many concerts. Oh. They have no money. <laughs> Same. Blink 182, September 20th, 9. It was okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was. Thank you, Atticus. Thank you. Thank you. Your old stuff is better. Yes. So you're, you're a Blink fan. Is 9 their 9th LP? Oh my god, not, is it? I didn't even put that together. Bruh. Probably. Probably. I hope so. Because if it's not, I'm going to be really mad. Yes, they missed an opportunity if it, if it isn't. But I'm pretty sure it is. Um, I haven't listened to it, but if it's anything like their um Dark Side music video, I will not listen to it. Um, or just Dark Side song. Um, and that's all I have to say about it. You know? Um, I hate it so much. Yeah, I... I'm not a fan. Wh- which one's my favorite album? It's it's really basic, but I love all the songs on it. Stream Blink-182 by Blink-182. You know? <laughs> I, I, That's all I have I, to say. I talked to Nick um, about the Dark Side music video when I saw him over summer, and he said, I'm really glad that Blink-182 is providing fun for the whole family. So that's <laughs> what I should tell you. Bruh. Yeah. Um, the Dark Side video was bad. That's all. Yeah, it was it was very not good. I got nine for fifty percent off on Black Friday. Still oh, to it. that's not a good sign for <laughs> yeah. them. Yeah, I got fifty percent off on Black Friday. I was like, I don't want to spend fourteen dollars on this album, but seven dollars, sure. Sure, so yeah. I did. That's and not like, how it goes. Yeah. yeah. I got yeah. a couple corn albums with it, and I was completely content with that. Born. 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 All right, finally. Ferris. Fan- oh wait, shoot! Water parks, October eleventh. Fandom. Oh my god! Uh, wow. Okay, I'm gonna break the ice here and say fandom is not their best album. If oh, anything, it is their um right, but not worst say. album. But if I had to rank their like uh, that's, that's their the top name of the song three, that they it have. would be at the bottom. So that's all I have to say. So glory's on right, the podcast. You shouldn't say it. <laughs> No, but honestly, like, if you look at all the other songs and composition from all their other albums, fandom is ranked at the bottom. I love all the songs, and it's my it's most really streamed like Water snacks. Parks album and singles and everything, but, like, it's not their best, in yeah, my opinion. I agree with Glory. I, um, it's my most streamed Parks release, but that's just because it's all I listened to the weekend that it dropped. Um... But other than that, I prefer other cool. Parks releases. So, fuck you. And it has the best album closer of 2019. Mm, it does. But other Actually, than that, yo, Blacklight uh, Gang? Haha. <laughs> I'll always say. be around is, like, real good, though. Fandom is I don't know about that. I Felt Younger When We Met is great, but, like, so, so is, so is, you know, always be around. Um, yeah. So like I'm no leather chief. I I think all their albums are great. Again, Austin, <laughs> if somehow you're listening, I love you. You know, but it's just not my favorite album. Stop, Stop talking. <laughs> and also, I'm a natural blue is like their best. Um, <laughs> oh God, I'm gonna make myself hard. <laughs> Pensive. Wait, <laughs> can I share it with them, please? <laughs> you can. <laughs> Check the podcast Bro. chat. <laughs> oh no! I don't. Why is it? Oh god, that's scary. <laughs> that is terrifying. But why is it good? Oh my god. <laughs> I love it. I'm adding it. It's an emote now. I'm no, making no. an emote. I oh, like man. how Rayanne's doing that instead of like participating in the podcast. I think, <laughs> yeah, I think that's the I best part of it. it. We were talking about it, and I had to. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Okay, I'm removing 
Remove so Billy. Don't do it. I'm removing Sad Yeehaw. Okay, good. And I'm adding a house server too. <laughs> Yeah, but the island has service cool. It's very important to me. <laughs> Download. Here we go. No, it's too. It's too powerful. You have to oh, um, trick it. Anyways, I can. I can get a small one. Hold on. Oh my god. Hold Anyways, <laughs> um, Young Blood, October eighteenth. The done. underrated youth. Eva, if you were here right now, we would be talking about this because everybody else on this podcast hates Youngblood. Hey, it's okay. I don't. I love you Young don't? Blood. Oh my god. Sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So, what would you think? He, I feel like he's a TikToker. Do. It's all good. He has TikTok energy. I, and he's really strong. So, I like the album. You're not talking um, because you know I'm right. What? Not talking because you know I'm right. What did you say? He has TikTok energy. He has TikTok? Is that bad? Yes. You're on TikTok! Bro? You're on TikTok, bro. That doesn't mean I like it. Oh my god. I love TikTok. Have you seen, like, the funny ones that are actually, like, Oh, the sillies on TikTok. Good. The sillies? Sillies on the, si the sillies! The quirky ones, you know? You know which ones I'm talking about. Yes. Yeah. So, there's some good things on TikTok. So, that's all I have to say. Yeah. Like me. Well, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm, I'm genuine. I'm, okay. Anyways, uh, Rex, Orn Re Rex know, Orange County, care. October 25th, Pony. Did anybody listen to it? No. Nope. That just. Me. That just. It was a very good album. It Moving on. <laughs> victims, aren't we all? Um, I wait, to, like, yeah, victims, the... aren't we all? November first, ugly. Ryan, did you listen to the entire album, or are you in the same boat as me? And listened to like half of it. <laughs> victims, aren't we all? Their album. Did you listen to that? What at band all? is that? <laughs> victims, aren't we all? It's Johnny's Johnny from Get Scared's solo act. Oh, I... Johnny, Johnny. Did you listen to that at all? I think I, I forgot to listen. I listened to like half of it when it dropped and it really didn't hold my attention, but it's Johnny from Get Scared, so I thought we would at least include it. It wasn't that bad, the couple songs I listened to, but like I said, it didn't hold my attention. I think that's all I have to say about that. Okay, empty that air. Cool. Um, so <laughs> all time low, November I'm, 8th. Still nothing personal. I would like to say, oh on the God, podcast episode, care. shut your mouth, Ferris, for two Let seconds. Let him speak. Oh, um, I was talking about all time low. All time low, still nothing personal. Uh, when this released, we had that podcast episode that we talked about it, and I sat uh -huh. there and shit on it the entire you time. Did. I did. You did. I did. Yes. And then I, and then you know, I had tickets to go see them live. Yeah, no flex, no flex or anything. I was there when uh, the the pit caved in on itself or whatever. Um, uh -huh. Yeah, you know, night one gang. Um, <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I should have worn God. my I should have worn my nothing personal sweatshirt. Because uh, oh, the tour God. shirts were ugly, so I got a sweatshirt. Anyways, um, I take back most of what I said about the album because the like the couple days before I went to go see them, that's all I listened to. I didn't actually listen to the original. Such a good album. I listened Such to the re-record of uh, It's Nothing Personal or Nothing Personal. Um, so, yeah. I take back most of what mm. I said. Most. Thank you. Most Thank of what you. I said. Um, I I still love it because what I said I was defending it the entire time and I was like, stop it! It's a good album and you're like, no, it's not and I was like, okay, and that was it. That that was that was the extent of our uh, discussion. What happened? Colorized. Yeah, basically, basically, yeah. Uh, super whatever number November fourteenth. Yours truly. Did anybody listen to that? I meant to listen to it because they're touring with Happy, and I love Happy. I don't know if you guys have noticed. Um, but yeah, um, that's it. What? Wow, they are loud. Oh my God, Jesus Christ. Yeah, but did anybody yeah. listen to that? Yours truly. No. Uh, no. Okay. Awesome. Great mm. energy, Ferris. <laughs> um, <laughs> first to eleven, November fifteenth. Covers volume four. Added that. You guys don't know it, but I added that. All right, go it's ahead. It's a great album. Okay, 
Can I just say that first to eleven, the lead singer, she is female. <laughs> she okay. Like, no shit. Okay. So That's I crazy. love her. And yeah, it's it's very good. I highly recommend. But it's like pop songs turned a okay. little bit heavier, kind of. Okay. Yeah, it's really good. Very much recommend. Anyways. I might have to check that. Uh, yeah. I don't know how. November 15th. Christmas yeah. drag. Alright. This is banger. This is watch. all of us right now. Okay. When that, cool. when that EP leaked... It was my birthday, and like the server blew up while it I went was. to go take my driver's test, and I came back, and we had like 50 members, and Rayanne had DM me, and she was like, "Bro, should we just yeah, like I make the leak public?" Yeah, Rayanne was like, "Dude, should we just like make the leak public?" Let's I'm like, do "Dude, it when I it just first leaked. I wanted to save my soul." Yeah. So, it was such. It's was, so good. That was a terrifying day. Um, yeah, it was. It was because I wasn't even a mod yet. And I was just like, yep, it's right there. Just, do you want the rule? Are you looking for the song? Okay, just, All there right, you just, go. And then leave five seconds <laughs> just, later. Just after take you it. From us. But yeah, yeah and then, it got to the point where every time someone joined, we were like, would you like the leaks and spoilers made, roll? We should, <laughs> made, we should have made the leaks roll, the auto roll for that day. Uh, honestly. Honestly. <laughs> and then Rayanne pinged everyone at like four o'clock. She's like, all right, enough people have joined. Like, we don't care. Here's the leak if you want it. Yeah, yeah exactly. We're done containing it to this chat, bro. It's too much work. Um, yeah. Up. It was a good album. Very good. Well, not album. EP. Very good. Um, my favorite was not Oh Noel. It was good, but it's not my You're favorite. Wrong. But um, Merry Christmas, everybody, is my favorite. Yes. Yes. Taste. Yes. Taste. Yes. It was festive. <laughs> <laughs> Falling in Reverse, November 20th. Oh Popular Monster. Alright. Oh Alright. Alright. I'm sitting up We're for this. We're both sitting up in our seats. We're sitting up for this. Popular Monster, I listened to, like, that was the only thing I listened to for like two days straight. I don't really like Falling in Reverse, although I've been meaning to give them a chance. And uh, Popular Monster absolutely Done. smacked. Ran, I think you could go more in depth than I could. Yeah. Um, Popular Monster, okay, bro. I remember DMing you at like 11 or something, yeah. and I was just talking about it because I was like, "We're gonna need to talk about this on our solo podcast yeah. or whatever." And well, I, I was like, "That oh, is, no, the, that is the only reason why I listened to it because we were talking about it on that solo yeah. podcast. I wouldn't have listened to it." <laughs> yeah, because the first thing I messaged you was like, "Oh no, it's rap, Ronnie. What are you doing?" <laughs> <laughs> no. And then. And then I was like, oh wait, this kind of slaps. Yeah, and, I and then it got it. really good, and I was like, damn. Yeah, and then I listened to it, mm. and I'm like, this isn't, this is like heavy, so I'm completely okay with it being rap. Like 100%. Like drugs, I've, gr drugs has also grown on me. Oh, I thought you meant like actual drugs. I was well, like, that uh huh. Too. <laughs> that too. Yeah. But, um, yeah, shame. Drugs with okay. it. I listened to drugs on the, at least two weeks. It was, I love that song so much. I remember everyone kept telling me to stop listening to drugs, and I was like, no. <laughs> no, it's good. It, it's a good song, and it's got Corey Taylor in it for like a hot second, so. That makes it great. Interesting. Wait, is, is the lead singer Ronnie? Rat, Rat, Ronnie Radke. Oh, he had um, yes, Twitter beef with um, Elijah Daniels. Daniel. Of course he did. He was put, I think he has beef with literally everybody. And, um, yeah. Point, you know? I don't know. Speaking of Ronnie Radke, I don't know. That's the only thing you know that he hasn't done wrong. I don't know if you guys know. He, does he hasn't done anything related to underage girls. Hot. Yes. No. Um, but he almost killed a couple of He's a lot of things, girls. but he's not a yeah, but not like, 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 what? So, that kind of thing. I don't know if you've seen the video of Ronnie Radke throwing a um, mic stand into the crowd in like 2012. Oh my god. That happened about a half an hour away from my house at Six Flags Great Adventure here in, at Six here Flags, in New Jersey. Gosh. They haven't had a metal festival since then, by the way. So Ronnie fucked it up all of us. 2012. Bro, didn't he like, have a meltdown on Twitter because Frank Iero run a what, rock sound award and he didn't? <laughs> Go Frank. Let's go. Let's go Frank. Yeah. So Ronnie Radke. Stand Radke. Frank. Don't stand Ronnie. Ronnie, Ronnie Radke bad. Die. Ronnie Radke music good. Radke, yeah, he's very talented, but like he's a horrible person. But yeah. he's very talented. So I listen to 
falling in the in reverse a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'm very sad that they're not bringing the uh, the drug in me and you is you 10th anniversary tour like anywhere near me. It's like New York. Like I can't drive into New York. So. I think Falling in Reverse is going to be the only band ever to not go to New Jersey. No, they they were they were here the day before I saw Andy Black. So May 3rd, 2019. Maybe. So I'm sure he'll be back and I will get tickets to go. Nice. Um Coldplay, Coldplay November 22nd, <laughs> Everyday Life. That's the anniversary of Danger Days, so, like, who cares? <laughs> Did anybody listen to Everyday Life? Oh. I'm do a little bit of it. It was pretty good. I mean, I like Coldplay, so. Okay, that's cool. That's but cool. they're, like, pretty poppy. Yeah, yeah. My favorite song on the new album was uh, Fallen Kingdom. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> that's... Okay. Um, the weekend, November twenty seventh, um, through November 29th, I'm just gonna say right. two singles. So Ryan and, I, and Ryan and I both listen to these because I made her listen to them. Um, but and her and I also have opposing views on which one's the better song. I think Heartless is the better of the two tracks, and you think yeah. Blinding Lights yeah. is the better one, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you I don't have I like the and he's wrong. I like um Blinding Lights because that's the one where he like because Heartless is the one where he talks about cats, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I wasn't of that. Well, I talks about figured. cats. Um, Dude, I don't. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, like, that's it. Granted, I've grown out of like that genre of music, but The Weeknd got me through a lot of shit. So like, I still no. go back and listen to his new stuff whenever it comes out, and I'll listen to like Starboy occasionally because that album came out while I was like dealing with that shit so that's where we're at yeah. and uh I still check it out I'll totally go see him live if and when he tours because he's definitely got an album coming out in 2020 so interesting eighth interesting grade, eighth so 2020 me, yeah eighth grade me um wanted to see him so bad and then my and then Mr. Highwind himself talked my mother out of bringing me so fuck Mr. Highwind god Mr. Highwind god damn it, so he's gonna avoid our interview and not let I can't believe this. Yeah, it's he's so toxic. He's so toxic. I can't. I can't. I have toxic. to unstand. Yeah. Disgusting. Yeah, we all have to collectively unstand. Yeah. Smile, empty soul. Number six, cheap. Did anybody <laughs> listen to that? I've never heard of that. Did um okay, that album came out. I haven't heard it, but I will listen to it. Harry Styles, oh December nineteenth, fine line. <sighs> oh my god! Okay, I have to prepare myself. Okay, Golden is such a good song. Treat people with kindness is such a good song. Fine line is such the entire album is a masterpiece, and yeah, I love it. I've I've listened to that album like. At least a hundred times all the way through, um, and it's it's yeah, it's great, it's great. What do you think about it, uh, Shane? I didn't hate it. You didn't hate it? No. Okay. What song was your favorite? Uh, oh, the, the 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 kindness one, right? Treat everyone. Yeah, you with treat people, with bro. Yeah. Taste, taste, taste. It's yeah. good. It's good. Yeah, yeah, that one. It's a very like good one. song. Yeah. Yeah. That one was good. That was the only one I remember. Yeah. <laughs> but like I was like listen listen I was like having a breakdown and at the same time I spent fifty dollars on the record for um for for uh my girlfriend so I was like I should probably like listen to the album considering I gave Harry Styles fifty of my own dollars. So Jesus. I uh I did that and it wasn't That's half, half a ticket, bro. It was half a ticket, bro. But I don't wanna go see Harry Styles live, so I'm like, let's get the vinyl instead. So Bro, he's so good. <laughs> bro just give me the money and i will go see him for you it's okay i will i will give you the rundown on what happened oh, really i'm right. um it's okay <laughs> ferris you have to say this next one because i i don't want to say it I'll so say i'm just it. gonna send it in the chat. There, there you go you have to say it how i said I it. it no i mean okay december 27th the final album Dag. sam listened to this and she said it was really good 
I've been meaning to listen to it because I really like his music. And when I say really like his music, I like that one song with Danny Gonzalez and Kellen and uh, Austin. I hate me too. Uh, um, uh, uh. So yeah, that's all. It, that's what if Danny Gonzalez did shit with fucking water parks? What? I know, right, dude? I, when I saw it, I was like, this isn't real. And then I heard him, and I was like, okay, guess it. Guess it. It happens. They are connected somehow, and they know each other, and. It's crazy because he's like one of my favorite YouTubers. So, yeah. yeah, yeah, that's awesome. Yo. Um, bring me the horizon. Oh my god, um, can I do it? Yeah, can that's I you. That's you. Okay. Remember to see the the name so, and then the date and then the album. Name. EP. I'm gonna list. I'm gonna read it all out. Okay. Okay. So it's music to listen to, dance to, blaze to. <laughs> Feed to, sleep to, talk to, grind to, <laughs> trip to, breathe to, help to, hurt to, scroll to, roll to, love to, hate to, learn to, plot to, play to, be to, feel to, breathe to, breathe to, sweat to, dream to, hide to, Live to, die to, go to. Thank you. Wow. Released wow. December twenty seventh. Crazy. Thank you for oh, the horizon. That. Very cool. I need to and listen 20, to it. Honestly, the twenty seven minute song. Amazing. Wow. Is there actually one? Yes. Is there actually one that has long? Wow. Homecoming. Yeah. Who? I don't know her. It's crazy. Do you other know songs are when? Like ten minutes long? All the other songs are about 10 minutes long, but there's one that's 27 minutes long. Rock oh my god. Right now. Wow, that is a uh, long song. Nice, nice. Yeah. That's what turned me off from this. Homecoming when? Who is she? Called, um, Never heard of her. Oh my god. Oh, it's called Underground Big. <laughs> okay. Nice. It's like caveman speak. <laughs> Um, Atticus just said that- one minute long, sorry guys. Oh, come on, bro. Atticus just said that I don't know how I was recording the album next ah. week. Ah. Bro. Ah. Oh, we're done with albums, by the way. That was our okay. year in review. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. yeah, okay. hopefully next year we'll, we'll be a little more put together, cause- Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, I don't know how. That's crazy. 2020 Final. already over. Final. They're recording the album. It's been what? We uh, have been waiting. It's happening. We've been waiting for it for so long, and they're finally doing it. I'm so excited. Hey, Rayanna, I'm gonna ping in. I don't know how. Fuck you. All right, go ahead. You don't have to be so mean about it. Fuck you. <laughs> and bro, so I'm pinging all yeah, I think that's um, people. I think that's the podcast. Yeah, people, bro. That is. I think we're good. Alrighty, and with that, I think we can uh. Uh, sign off, bro. So, I'm um, I'm Shane. Don't call me God. <laughs> I'm Glory. I'm Ferris. Bitch. Yes, I'm Rayanne. I guess I don't know anymore. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. Oh. Doesn't know her name. I don't know who I am anymore. IDK How is doing shit. Yeah, it's and quirky. I don't know who I am. Atticus. <laughs> Atticus. Yes. Hello. Sign off. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, right. we're signing off. Good night. <laughs>